Hi guys, JM Kong back at you with another video. This video will be pretty cool. Basically, I'm gonna boot a MacBook Pro on the Linux. Um, I'm gonna be running Ubuntu Linux off of a DVD. I know you can run Ubuntu off of a um, CD, or, but uh, we don't have any left, so um, I just use the DVD. If you guys want to know how to uh, burn an ISO file onto a DVD or a CD, please tell me so and I will be willing to help you. To get the same distribution as uh, the one that I have, Ubuntu Linux, I'm going to put a link in the description box to your right. So, yeah. Um, as, as I probably told you earlier, this is a MacBook Pro. Uh, and then we go to about this Mac. It's running Mac OS 10 10.5.6. Um, it has 2.4 gigahertz Intel Core 2 Duo and 2 gigs of RAM. And that's basically it for the specs. And let's get this video rolling. Here's the Linux um, DVD that I burned. Let's do this. Let me put this in here and restart my computer. Wait until, um, hold down the C key. I was gonna say wait until the bong and then hold down the C key, but this is a happy end. Come and give me your hand. I'll take you far away. I'm a new soul. I came to this strange world, hoping I could learn a bit about how to give and take. But since I came here, felt the joy and love feel, finding myself making every possible mistake. And there you have it. Just hit escape on here, every time the menu comes up, but it's fine. Just hit enter on the top one. Let me reposition my tripod and zoom in for you. You can see my glare. And there you go. Loading the Linux kernel. Sweet. The main big problem with Linux on a Mac running um, from disk is it doesn't have any drivers in. Like uh, my volume control doesn't work, uh, my eject key doesn't work I think, and on it obviously because the CD is in there and it's running it, <laughs> ejecting it might freeze it up. Um, my brightness doesn't work. And um, the internet doesn't work because um, I don't have uh, I I need to set up my internet connection. But it's it, it's it's a good uh, way to get a hold of um, Linux, like um, get used to it. Just run it off a of DVD or a CD. There you go. It's loading the bar. As you can tell, it's loading pretty fast from a DVD. I've seen other people have like CDs and um, they load way more slower. Of course, they are CDs, not DVDs. But whatever. Here comes the cursor and here comes the welcome screen. And there you have it. 
the Linux desktop. Um, that's basically it. Um, um, here's the menu, the uh, normal standard um, Linux menu. And yeah, um, Firefox is on here, but um, like I said before, the internet doesn't work. And I just realized something. My keyboard brightness is not working. <laughs> the backlit. Um, yeah. And something that I used to on the Mac side, right click doesn't work. I hope you guys enjoyed <laughs> booting this. No, uh, no drivers Linux. <laughs> and to shut down this, as you probably can tell, I already launched the menu over there. Um, to shut down Linux, you shut it down over there, rather than OS X, you shut down over here. And Windows, there's a start button, and then you shut down on the start menu. So, to shut down, go to the last option. You can also do sleep, restart, you name it. And push enter, and let's see Linux shut down. Enter. And it shuts down your computer. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and see you guys on my next video. Bye.